Blood of Baal Chandor is a hardback novella from Fantasy Flight Games set in their Arkham Files universe. It stars Dexter Drake, who has appeared in a number of Arkham Files games. It is just under 9 inches by 6 inches by 6 sixteenths. And for size comparison, here are some other Asmodee products to give you a better idea. Fantasy Flight Games released a series of five books beginning in October 2017 and concluding in April 2018. Now, two years later to the month, another lone title has joined the fold. Well, sort of. It is written by Richard Lee Byers. He was the fellow that wrote Ira of the Void, starring Storming Norman. So you have had a chance to see how well he handles the Arkham Files setting. Other than that, he has authored more gaming novels than you can shake a stick at most notably in the Forgotten Realms setting, but also including Pathfinder and the Iron Kingdoms, and if you go back far enough, World of Darkness too. Wraith the Oblivion? What a crazy idea. This is the same format as its companion volume, so you'll get some very bland pages and then a burst of colour at the back. Despite the high price, this book has mostly average paper stock, with no art for the flyleaf or cover linings or ribbon to serve as a page marker. The binding looks to be glued and stitched, so you won't have any problem opening it all the way and eventually it will lay flat. This volume begins with a full page teaser to whet your appetite. Then the credits and title page follow, and onto a cool one page summary of the world of Arkham Files that really sets the scene for 1920s Arkham with its supernatural shadows. The main story is 15 chapters for a total of 96 pages, including a single page about the author. This is the same length as three of the other titles. None of the chapters have names, but the first one has a date, and there's no table of contents either. Finally, there are generous 15 pages of full colour in character documents to evoke the setting and help you follow along with the mystery. Although these are basically texts, they have been dressed up superbly as newspaper articles, letters, diaries and grimoires. And for goodness sake, someone buy the blinking investigators of Arkham as this is the sixth advert in a row. As we have seen from previous testing, these hardbacks are definitely robust. But don't go crazy. The reason most of you will be interested in this book is that it comes with promo cards for Arkham Horror the Card Game, as foretold by this little sticker here. At the back you get a complete pack of Dexter Drake Investigator cards contained within a Ziploc bag, which we may make a separate video about, but so you don't all freak out and push the dislike button here is a preview. You get an alternate art version of his Investigator card and also the mini card. Plus, replacement signature bonus and signature weakness. If you don't know how replacement cards work, there is a handy rules insert. Or you could just watch our amazing explanation in tutorial number 24. This is currently the only way you can get hold of Dexter Drake. Just like Norman and Silas, this hasn't been tied to a particular product yet. It was expected to release in April, but due to the 2020 health crisis, Fantasy Flight Games announced they would be delaying the release of all new releases in North America, which includes its 51st state, the UK. So, see their website for the latest information. It has been available in Europe and some other parts of the world, however, and thanks to the generosity of our amazing patrons, we were able to order this copy from overseas. Although it may be sold out since the making of this video. For those that can bear to wait to order from the source, then they are still offering free US shipping and a pre-order bonus. If you are looking on the FFG website, then you will need to head to the Products tab. Click on Arkham Files, then go down to the Arkham Fiction page. The top entry is the Arkham Horror Novellas. If you expand that, then the Blood of Baal Shandor is the last entry. At the time of filming, it is still marked as pre-order. Looking for it on the Asmodee store, it doesn't come up with all the other novellas strangely. You either need to come from the pre-order link on the FFG site, or type in Blood of Baal Shandor on the search box. The reason you might want to get it directly from the source is free US shipping and an exclusive bookmark. A bookmark? That's right, normally all Arkham LCG pre-orders come with four or more 5x7 art cards, but that is because those products contain lots of artwork. It's not like this makes a big thing of any kind of full colour art. 
If you just want the stories, you can normally save a huge amount of money by purchasing these novellas digitally from Amazon for your Kindle or drivethroughfiction.com for various formats. Note that any digital version will not come with the lovely full colour illustrations. Although, sadly, there is no sign on either of these websites. Not even a pre-order. Oh, go back! The Battletech Activity Book! Oh, click on that! I don't like a bit of colouring in me!